Hey what's up YouTube, in this video I'll be showing you how to make a barrel in Minecraft. This barrel will go really well with all your other build and every block builds and we're actually getting a pretty good world at the moment. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to never miss another upload. And without any further ado, let's get started. Before I start the video then, I just want to make one quick note that this build was given by a suggestion and you might be able to see him on the screen right now by Mr. Garcia Plays. This is what your suggestion can do for the channel. If you don't mind, leave a suggestion. It will get make us very, very far and it will get your shout out. So now let's get started. So before we get started, everyone, here are all the blocks we'll be needing. Spruce planks, dark oak planks, light grey concrete and grey concrete. Block space we will be needing for this barrel is a 16 by 6 16 block area. I would recommend building in this world and it, as it will help you very, very much. And make sure you've got all them materials. Make that grid and once you have, we can begin. So come down to the bottom left corner of your grid. Place a spruce plank. Go right of it by 15. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Go up on this block by 15. Just like that. Now we want to go across off of this spruce plank until it lines up to the spruce plank we, the very, very first spruce plank we placed. Might be easier to bring it up to where it should be first and then connect it along the top. Just like that. So we should have just a spruce cube like that. It's not a cube, it's a square. You want to come, you now just want to add a layer of dark oak planks inside the layer of spruce planks we've already created. And this will limit a lot of the space we'll be having to use. And yeah, I'm going to be doing this in five separate sides because it is quite a difficult build to make. So once you've got that, what you want to do now is on every one of the corners, you want to place a dark oak plank, just like that. Go left and up. And you want to place a dark oak plank up and then go right. You want to place a dark oak plank, go le left, right, le what way? Anyway, just keep doing that. <laughs> Just keep doing a corner of three in each one and it should give you a nice spherical shape. Now the next bit we want to do is we want to grab our spruce planks again. We want to come down to this bottom corner there where we first placed our block. Where this dark oak plank is we want to go up by three. One, two, three, yeah. We want to place a light grey concrete. One on top. One to the left. And a grey concrete. I just want to fill this entire area in with spruce planks. It's not that much as we have limited a lot of the space using the dark oak planks, the outside and the little bit of light grey and grey concrete. But it will give this a really, really cool effect and it does look really nice. I think I might do... Um, Actually, like after I've finished all these builds, is like make a massive house, like a village house, a large version of a village house, and make it using all these build and every block tutorials. It look really cool. Don't know if I make that into a tutorial or not. Anyway, so once you've done that side, now I want to come over to your right, the right side of the barrel. First thing you want to do is just have a look a second yeah you want to go from the bottom so you want to go to the bottom corner and you want to go two spruce planks and place a light grey concrete a grey concrete then you want to come to the other side there's three spruce planks light grey grey and fill them in inside in with spruce planks now i want to go up on this spruce up to the top or where you should be I think I've gone one too high there. That's right, is that right? So one second guys, I'm a bit confused here. I think I've one, one too low. Thinking. Yeah, it's definitely one too low. I need to put one more on top of this, I was right first time. So, now all you want to do is just connect the spruce planks. The two spruce, light grey, light grey. And then you want to come to the other side, two spruce, light grey, grey. 
the little with spruce. One second, did I? Yeah, I did. I got that wrong, didn't I? Place grey and then light grey. Sorry, guys. So it's literally light grey, grey at the bottom. Whoops. Grey at the bottom. So it should look like that. So it should all match up nicely then. What I want you to do is just join up the light greys and the greys. Just join them up top to bottom. All four of them. That's two. Three. And then one more. That's four. Right. So you should have this. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to get your dark oak planks. And just place a layer on top of the spruce planks. Just like that. On this side, I want you to have three spruce, one dark oak. Three spruce, one dark oak. Three spruce, one dark oak, and then one spruce. And you should have this. And you want to just join all of these across. I'm just going to go over top to bottom. Three, three layers of spruce, one layer of dark oak, all the way up until you get to the top, and there should only be one layer of spruce. So that's two. That's four. Three and then one layer of dark oak. I just want to do this all the way to the top, so it should be three spruce. There's one, two, three, one dark oak, one, two. Three spruce, instead of block, one dark oak, and then one more spruce. And it will give a really nice effect. I, mean, I, never, I didn't show you it, did I? Sorry. There we go. So it should give you a really, really nice effect for your barrel. You now want to come to the left side of your barrel. It's a bit tighter here because of the chest behind me. And you just want to place a two spruce, gap of two. Spruce, you would have to do from the, then and then three more. Go all the way up with the spruce till you get to the top. Go two spruce. Bit from the other side, do two spruce. You should have that. Then that's like that. No, I've done it. One, two, low again, haven't I? There it is. What is wrong with me today, guys? Can't seem to get it right. I just want to go two spruce. Let, maybe place two there just to like, tell you where it is. And do spruce all the way until you got two blocks gap, just like that. Now what I want you to do is grab your light grey and your grey. You just want to join, go across the top of the build till it reaches the side, and then go down. Just connect it all the way down to the ground, just like that. I just do the same with the grey. Just like that. I'm going to do the grey. Do the grey first, it's in my hand already. Thought it would be a bit easier. The reason I'm leaving the back till last is because it's one the hardest side. These really three sides are really simple. But they're really tedious because you're just doing the same thing. And the back is just like a bit more complex than the other sides. So you want to do the same thing here, you want to place a row of dark plank, dark oak, three rows of spruce. Like I said, this bit is here is really tedious. That's one row done, two rows, and three rows. And then you want to place another row of dark oak planks. This one row. And this is two, three, and then one row of dark oak planks. I want to place another row of spruce, three rows of spruce, sorry, yeah, that's one, two, three, row of dark oak. And then another entire row of spruce. So you should have that. It's a bit hard to see it because of the chest, like I said, but you might be able to see it in your world a bit better. Yeah, I can get it from that angle, that's better. So now you've got to come to the top of your build. And 
Yeah, so trying to read my instruction. Give me a second. Yeah, so what you want to do is you want to come to not this side, this side, the other side. You want to come to the right side. You want to place a row of dark oak planks spanning the width of the block. Not on the end block. On the end block, you want to destroy it. And you want to place spruce connecting the two top corners together. It's going to go from the right top right corner, to the top left corner, at the back of the build. Just like that. Oh dear, oh dear. Right, now once you place this, these, this row of dark oak planks, you then want to place yourself. One second, I'm reading my instructions wrong, just give me. Yeah, so you want to place three rows of spruce, dark oak, three rows of spruce, dark oak, three rows of spruce, dark oak, one row of spruce. I think it'll probably be easier if I just do one section at a time, so I'll leave a gap of one from there where the dark oak could be, and then do them three. Leave a gap of one, do another three spruce, another three spruce. Gap of one again, and then another six spruce there, like that. Then want to do it on the top bit, so it'll just be spruce going up over here. And you want to do this bit here. That's one. Two and that is three, nearly three. There we go. Oh dear. Now you just want to connect your dark oak planks through. So, get them all the way through and then do that. Do them here first and then I'll connect them through the middle. I think it's actually quite a much quicker way. I don't know why I didn't do this first time. Anyway. So you should have that, which looks really nice. If I go to the front of the build, you won't even tell there's not a back. But it just gives you a little quick sneak peek of how it look. Although we've done the back, so it looks really, really nice. Now, want the back a bit more complex to all the other three sides. But what I want you to do is to come to the bottom, and place an entire row of spruce planks on the bottom. Get your dark oak planks and place another inner row of dark oak planks, like what we did on the front. So you just want to do the exact thing that we did on the front, you just place another entire row of dark oak planks. I cannot, cannot get this one sec. No? Come on. There we go. Then we just want to come all the way down, connect to the bottom, like that. You give it like a little trim. Now I want to split this barrel up into three or into four into four yeah we'll start from the top of this so you leave a gap of one from the top and then just do an entire row of dark oak planks you then want to leave a gap of three so that's one two when I mean, it's hard to see with the dark plank one two three so it should be there yep yeah. and then just draw a line through the barrel I find it so hard to do it sideways an entire line through the barrel Another gap of three, that's one, two, three. Do it on this block here. It should leave you a gap of two at the bottom, so you know if you've done it right, if you've got a gap of two at the bottom, if not, yeah. You should have a barrel that's been split up into four, it's not that even, I know, but yeah. Anyway, we want to split up the bottom and the second top section. So we're going to start at the bottom, we're going to leave a gap of five from this side, so it's, we're going to leave a gap of five, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six block place, two dark oak planks going up. You now I just want to follow that dark oak plank through to this section here and just draw a line going up, and that's it. Now you just want to fill in this entire area in with your spiritual planks. So. So we're just going to continue to do this, it doesn't take very long. And after this I think we are done on, yeah we're done on a barrel after we've done this. 
So I'm just gonna clear up these last two little bits, and that's what your, the back of the barrel should look like. Like I said, it's a little bit more complex to all the other three sides. So that's your bar barrel 100% completed, and I'm gonna clean up everything that's on the floor, all the numbers on the floor. I'll see you in a minute. So this is what your barrel will look like once it's been 100% fully completed. If you did like the video, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to never miss another video. Don't forget to leave a suggestion as well in the comment section below to see what blocks you would like next to see next. Um, this world is getting crazy now, the amount of bills we're getting. I just like more suggestions and I can get on with them and you'll be mentioned in the video. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Good. Bye.